Uh, first off, uh, we have some, uh, I think, some good news for our state. Today we are expanding more opportunities for more states or more counties to be able to move to phase two of our recovery program. Today, we're announcing new criteria that will allow 10 more counties to apply for a variance to allow them to move forward uh, on their phase two operations. And they will be eligible to apply uh, if they have less than 10 new cases per 100,000 residents over a 14-day span. Uh, this criteria for the next phase of our uh, recovery plan is consistent with the CDC guidelines for opening regions nationwide. This obviously is happily going to allow more economic opportunity for states that uh, uh, can qualify, while still really providing the protections we need for the health of our citizens. So um, uh, if I can show you the 10 counties that will be eligible to apply for these variances, uh, now on the map are Spokane, Adams, Mason, Thurston, Lewis, Clark, Clallam, Kitsap Island, and San Juan uh, counties. Uh, we also uh, will show you the graph now of all the counties that are either already have been uh, cleared for phase two and the new eligible counties. So as of Monday, we have approved 10 counties to move into phase two of our four phase safe start recovery plan. And that's based on their population and lack of COVID-19 cases. Combined with Jefferson and Grays Harbor counties, which are eligible for a variance but haven't applied as of yet, that makes 22 counties in the state that are currently eligible uh, uh, for a variance upon application or are already moving to phase two. Combined, these counties represent about 30% of the state's population. Um, as we open up more of our state, I just want to note that our dependence on our local officials in local decision making will increase uh, and the need to adhere to our remaining restrictions will obviously be very important for the health of their citizens. Uh, phase two uh, has restrictions on activities including crowd sizes as well as mandatory protections for workers. These are very important. Uh, these need to be followed uh, so we can save more lives obviously. And if the local leaders are ready to take on that responsibility, uh, we expect that they'll do so in a very careful and thoughtful way and follow the guidance to keep their citizens safe. I know counties applying want to serve their residents and uh, not just the whole state. Uh, one other thing I want to note that as we open up some of our counties on a more county-based uh, uh, metric, it really is important for people not to overload those smaller, frequently smaller communities uh, in their restaurants or otherwise. It's really a time to remain close to home. And we know some of these smaller communities have tried to reiterate that with, with us so that they are not uh, overwhelmed. So I hope people can keep that in mind.